weather here in Ohio brings chaos just across the state line. A viewer sent us this incredible video of a funnel cloud forming in Pennsylvania. It wasn't long before that twister ripped apart this nursing home, tearing down walls, ripping the roof clear off, leaving the elderly in their wheelchairs with nowhere to go. Tonight, the National Weather Service confirmed, yes, it was an EF2 tornado that caused all that damage. So we sent News 5's Amanda Van Allen over to Conneautville, Pennsylvania to show us the impact. From lugging beds inside to pushing their elderly neighbors to safety, they're all working together. There's a lot of people that have just showed up from the community that said, how can we help? Jaron Sperry is the superintendent of the Conneaut School District in Pennsylvania. He opened up the local middle school to house 170 residents forced out of the Rolling Fields nursing home. That's where a tornado nearly demolished it. Windows were blown out. Pieces of the building now lay in the street and just a few steps away. This connecting building is completely obliterated. The roof blown off, the walls now on the ground, and all of their personal belongings are all over the grass. Even some precious memories. Shock to her. <laughs> Very She's scary, huh? Oh, yeah, they were there, they were there after to take care. 93-year-old Ruth Patch was inside when the storm hit. Her best friends rushed to pick her up. So we just want to make sure she's okay. We know that everybody's taking good care of her, but we just want her to come home with us. Some of the displaced residents were hanging out at a local fire station until they could get everyone to the middle school. That's likely where most of the residents will sleep, at least for a bit. Right now, they're bringing everybody here. Uh, they're going to they're gonna, uh, kind of triage them. You can see some of that's happening right over here to the left and they're going to move them to other nursing homes. They're bringing in food, water, and more generators to keep everyone safe. Surprising at all what is happening right before your eyes right no, now? No, no, because this is what this community does. In Crawford County, Pennsylvania, Amanda Van Allen, News 5.